Well, a, a, a constituent uh, was dealing with a lot of the tra uh, tourist traffic that we have out in Yamhill County. And so they said, there's all these bicyclists out there and they're not paying for any of the roads that we're paying for. And so they said, why don't we get some folks to broaden the base and get them to pay some of the cost of maintaining the roads. Um, and what is the situation like for a guy that is driving on that road, a farmer? Well, the roads were built for farm to market roads, but now with the winery, uh, tourism and the bike riding, Yamhill County has really become a tourist destination for people who are using country roads. And so they become quite congested out there, especially during uh, harvest season. And so people are just a little frustrated and they want to make sure that we got to improve these roads, but how do we share the burden of improving these roads so we can take on the tourist traffic? No, I think the, the interesting thing on, on this story is that you are a, a conservative who is against taxation, against fees and, and smaller government, and this is sort of going the opposite direction of that. Well, I think that when you look at roads, roads are something that we all share the cost. And what we do is we gas taxes, how many miles you drive. And so when you use the roads, you pay for the roads. And that's how our system works. So what happens is when you have people who use the roads and don't pay for the roads, then all it does is shift the burden to somebody else. So okay. it's about evening out the, the burden. Okay. And so you were saying this, you, uh, are you hoping this passes? If you hope this gets through? I, I like the idea of having a conversation about it. I've never thought about it before until the constituent brought it to me. And so I'm more than willing when a constituent asks me for a bill to go ahead and introduce it and get the conversation started. But if, the, if it got traction? It definitely is something that needs to be addressed because there are a lot of people using roads that aren't paying for them. So how do we, how do we share that burden? And so it's, it's a very interesting idea and some of our best ideas come from our constituents. Okay, and then do you have a bike? Do you, do, what? do you ride a bicycle? Not very often. When I go, when I go on vacation. <laughs> what would you say to uh, uh, folks that are about to buy a bike and they're maybe worried there's a ten dollar fee on it? Uh, maybe it discourages business. Well, more importantly, the idea is is that it should open up additional dollars for new bike paths. It should enhance their riding experience because what's happened is is that when those dollars came in, then you know, safety sidewalk or uh, bike lanes, those kind of things could be, could be put in places so they would be safer and, and it'd be better for the bicyclists.